Hey guys, so this is the next look in the Disney collaboration that I'm doing with The Beauty Within 1987, and this week we are doing Aladdin. Um, I chose to do the genie. Um, he is my favorite character in the movie, and I love him so much, and Robin Williams, rest in peace, um, is by far my favorite actor of all time, and it's so hard now to watch Aladdin or think about it without getting emotional, so, um, but I really wanted to do this kind of look in, you know, kind of, um, in memoriam of Robin Williams and his character as the genie. Um, I based the look mainly around the lamp that Aladdin found. Um, so I have a gold lid and the blue liner for the color of his body and then red lips for the arm cuffs that he wears. Um, I really wanted it to be uh, a little bit more wearable than my normal looks. You can pair this with a nude lip if you want to for not as contrasted lips <laughs> like mine. Um, so this look is very wearable and if you're trying to get into color and trying to be a little bit more daring with makeup and color, this would be a really good look to kind of int to intertwine that into your look. <laughs> You guys know what I mean. But, um, I had a lot of fun doing this look, and it's really shimmery, really fun, has a little mystical, magical element, and I love it. So, um, enough babbling, and I really hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial. Uh, if you like it, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and on the tutorial. Okay, so... First thing is to apply your primer. I'm just going to use the Urban Decay. And apply it all over the lid up to the brow. And the main colors I'm going to be using today are from the Urban Decay uh, Mariposa palette. And the first color I'm going to use is Limelight, which is a really pretty, um, shimmery, golden champagne color. And I'm going to take it on a brush like this, and apply it all over my lid, and bringing it up into my crease. Then I'm going to be taking the spotlight and kind of putting that on the outer part of the um, limelight. And then taking wreckage, I'm just going to um, kind of define my crease with it. And I'm using the same brush for all three colors just so it's more of a seamless look and it's not really harsh because we want the main focus to really be on the bold blue liner so we don't really want too much to interfere with the um, liner. And if you want to deepen it up a little bit more, you can take a little bit of mushroom and put it on the outer V. I'm not going to just because I really want the blue liner to pop really, really well. So I'm going to add just a little bit more gold. Um, and I'm going to use the Maybelline Color Tattoo Pure Pigment in Wild Gold. And 
I'm just going to kind of place it on the inner half of the lid and blend it out a little bit just so that inner portion is a little bit brighter. And then I'm going to add a highlight. I'm just going to use Skimp from the Mariposa palette. Okay, and now for a liner, I'm going to use my Wet n Wild um, Fergie On Edge Longwear Eye Pencil, and this is in Hyper Sky. And it's a really pretty, kind of light blue. Um, if you have a blue, teal, turquoise gel liner, you can use that instead. But since I don't, I'm going to just use the pencil. And I'm going to do quite a thick wing. On top of that, to help it set, I'm going to go back in the Mariposa palette and use height and go over it to set the liner. I'm just using a really small Sedona lace brush. This is the EB21. And I'm going to line my lower lash line with the black Fergie liner in Midnight Girl. I'm going to take a super super thin line of liquid liner on the top um, using the e.l.f. precision eyeliner. I mean super thin. Just so it kind of has a little bit of definition but not so much. And we're not going to wing it out or anything like that. And now, mascara. I'm using the CoverGirl Flamed Up Mega Curl Lashes in very black. And I'm really loving this mascara because it has a curved wand and it really like helps your lashes keep that curl. And that is it for the eyes. Alright, so for lips, you can do quite a different variety of lips. You can do blue to match the eyeliner. You can do a nude lip. And you could do a red lip and that's what I'm doing today. I'm going to be using the Urban Decay Super Saturated Ultra Gloss Lip Color and Theodora. It was from the the Great and Powerful Oz collection. And um and that is the final look. It's really fun and flirty and mystical, magical glitteriness, and I love it. Definitely check out Veronica's um, Aladdin-inspired look, which will be linked at the end of the video, and also down below, where you can check it out. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will talk to all of you later. Bye!